1980, Sam Ritigliano went to the wire 13 times with the Cleveland Browns. Nine years later, the 56-year-old head coach is reliving the drama. The kick is on its way, and it's perfect. The final minute field goal lifted Liberty over Eastern Illinois two weeks ago, and with 11 seconds to play last week, Eric Green made a spectacular catch to upset Eastern Michigan. The latest version of Sam's Cardiac Kids returned to Lynchburg for homecoming 89. Television Sports presenting NCAA football, number 11 Liberty, facing the Tigers of Towson State. From the Willard May Stadium on the campus of Liberty U in Lynchburg, Virginia, it is Liberty Homecoming 1989. The unbeaten and 11th ranked Flames take a challenge from Towson State. The scene just two days ago, construction workers working around the clock to have the stadium ready for game time. And today it opens in the shadow of Liberty Mountain, a sellout crowd in excess of 12,000 expected for today's game. Hi, everybody. I'm Mike Tilly, joined with Dave Hoagland. 12,000 people expected to cram into the stadium. Dave, a momentous day in Liberty's athletic program. Yes, an exciting day for the Flames. After 17 years, the Flames play their first home game on the campus of Liberty University. And it's also homecoming. Indeed, Dave. And Liberty playing Townsend State. Townsend State is 1-5. and five. they got to get the ball to their flanker. Yes, the man they want to see in action today is Mike Smith. He's a wide receiver, 5'11", from Clifton, Virginia. They want him to have the football and let him see what he can do. But the story is not who's here. The story is who's not here. Graduation has sent Dave Maggard to the New York Giants. The defense is centered by with Rodney Smith, a nose guard, an All-American candidate, someone we'll have to watch coming off some injuries. For Liberty, Robbie Justino starts at quarterback with Paul Johnson trying to recover from his knee surgery. He should see some action, but Justino is the man today through the winning touchdown to beat Eastern Michigan last week. Eric Green caught the winning pass. The Flames will try to find the senior tight end. He's number three in receiving in the country, but he has a tender toe, and we'll see how he adapts to the turf. We're counting down to kickoff. Liberty U and Towson State at the Willard May Stadium. Stay with us. 